Okay. The time is 10:08 a.m. Monday. My work starts about 11, so I got a bit of time to talk. Just a little bit of a follow-up to the dashcam installation. Uh, I've installed a, I've, I've installed dashcam and everything, and I've also installed a Celink Neo battery. This one is the uh, the large 6,000 milliamp battery dashcam battery. I've just sat it down on my underneath my driver's seat, so it's hardwired onto the fuse with a fuse tap. It's the fuse tap that uh, that's only on when the vehicle is running on the on position. Now this one is powering my dash cam right now. It, it's pretty good. It takes only an hour to um, uh, to to re recharge it. So that's around about my commute anyway, probably one way. And for this dash cam for the uh, DR900S Blackview, it's saying it'll be about 15 hours of recording. I think that's with um, that's parking mode recording, which is the time lapse mode and motion sensing or, or impact sensing in case something happens uh, in case of event recording so far I, I'm, I'm liking the system this is this is me finalizing the uh, this dash cam system it gives me the peace of mind when I'm leaving the car just uh, for eight hours at a time like when I'm at work and it's at the car park and like this car park this is just this is just outside so anything can happen behind me there's cars at the back as well. It's just good to have this kind of surveillance because there's no uh, there's no cameras around the car park. I don't think there's cameras around the car park anyway, so this is my way of having some surveillance. You gotta you gotta protect your car, you know, protect your investment. It's not an investment, but this is something that I'm going to be using for a few years. If something happens, I need something for insurance. So that I don't have to have to take the blame and things like that if I'm not at fault. In other news, I just got a uh, uh, kind of like an employment offer for another job for the government. I just need to um, to sign some declaration forms and then email it back to the recruiter and have them uh, send me after they they sign that off that they, after they check that out, have them uh, give me a uh, or send me through a, uh, an employment offer, an official offer of employment. I'm gonna check that out and see if, um, if it's going to be, if it's going to, go, to be good. It, it probably is, hopefully, fingers crossed, because I need a change anyway, so. I think now's the time to, uh, to, change, to change jobs and things. We'll see. But for now, I'm gonna go to work and uh, I'm probably gonna check out a couple of tracks that my producer has sent me. I'm just gonna check out to see him because we, we just lost our guitarist and uh, our other one so I'm going to be playing uh, some other stuff so I gotta check the tracks out see if they're good give some confirmation and things like that I'm probably gonna listen to it now and afterwards I'm gonna go to work anyway we're back home work felt pretty long started off pretty good then energized for the day and then it just dropped off for some reason Hmm. Tomorrow's another day. But for now, I gotta test out the uh, the tracks that we have from that we've received from the producer. I'm gonna see how that goes, make some corrections that are necessary before the final backing tracks get uh, get compiled. Okay, got the PRS here and the mini amp. I'll test out this one song first. That rhythm's not supposed to be there. That's not supposed to be there, that rhythm. And that rhythm's not supposed to be there either. <sighs> Couple of things that need to be removed from the track, the main rhythm guitar, which I'm supposed to be playing on, uh, on live on stage. Some things have to be taken off.
I nearly forgot as well. I totally forgot that I still need to kind of relearn the songs now. Pretty much with the new lineup that we have, which is not kind of like a four piece because of one less uh, band member. Used to have uh, two guitarists in the band, so you know, five piece. And that's just me as the guitarist. So I gotta revise my part so that next band practice I'm going to be ready. I'm gonna be practicing soon due to our, our next upcoming tour in Melbourne which is pretty much the end of this month uh, 28th of September so I gotta be ready for that as well better get practicing then anyway it's, uh, I'm gonna sort that out and send the tracks through meanwhile I've done the scans for my declaration form sign them and scan them email them back to the recruiter for the government uh, uh, entity that I'm applying for applying a job for but today's um, a stressful day and I'll end the vlog right here right now and, and I need to uh, figure this track out, edit the vlog and have some rest because uh, this introvert is overloaded. But thanks for hanging. I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Laters. You were just a